You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. The Ministry of National Defence Deputy Prime Minister Tia Bun has urged the Senior Provincial Authorities to manage the natural resources and the forest conventions area collective with other relevant militaries, institutions and local authorities in order to resolve ongoing land entrenchments issues more quickly. The Cambodian Defence Minister made these remarks during the closing ceremony of the meeting to summarise the work results of 2021 and the work direction of 2022 of the Senior Provincial Administration Tuesday morning. EAC News reporter Dekin Nin has more details. Deputy Prime Minister Thie Bang has stated that in order to ensure the effectiveness of the work to manage natural resources and forest conservation areas, the Provincial Administration, Municipal Administration, District Administration and Commune Administration must together ensure the proper implementation of the principles and measures set by the relevant ministries and institutions. He stated that as the chairman of the Provincial State Land Management Commission, he urges the provincial administration to cooperate with other ministries and institutions in defining border posts and registering land to prevent illegal encroachment on state-owned land areas and forests in protected areas. He stressed that the state must expedite the settlement of land disputes as soon as possible to avoid them spreading and becoming more complicated and difficult to resolve. He advised that in resolving land disputes and local protests, efforts must be made to avoid all forms of violence and the monitoring and control of encroachment on people's land in protected areas and forests must be increased to prevent any further illegal intrusions. Deputy Prime Minister Thie Bang also recommended to village and commune authorities not to sign documents of sale, transfer or ownership any documents of illegal land tenure in protected areas and to continue to educate, guide and disseminate information on forest law, fishery laws and laws on protected areas to local authorities, citizens and stakeholders so that they can more actively participate in the protection of forests and natural resources. He stated that the forest in Phnom Kulin area in particular must be protected because it is an important source of water supply for Siem Reap province. Dekanin, AAC News.